Good morning, Parkview. This is uh, uh, an opportunity for the care team to be able to speak up a little bit. My wife, Ty, Kirkpatrick, and myself, we have been uh, energetically working with the, the care team, has been looking after all the people that are in homes that can't get out in, in care centers and stuff like that. And we just wanted to share a little bit about how important this is that we have as a congregation. So I'm going to turn it over to my wife here. She can share a little bit of the feelings as a woman we feel. Uh, good morning, Parfu. Uh, we just want to come to you this morning and invite you to come alongside of us and um, reach out to those people that are in an assisted living, in a nursing home, a shut-in. Um, you know, Brian's been doing a series called Stuck. And um, we are still in the midst of this pandemic. And can you imagine being in a facility and not being able to leave to <clears throat> even go outside or go to the grocery store, uh, which we can now do. And so we would just like you to come alongside of us, um, pick up a directory or look at it online. Um, those people are listed at the very beginning of the directory. Um, send them a card, give them a phone call. Mm -hmm. um, they just need to know that um, we at Parkview love them and care about them and um, they would so much appreciate to hear uh, from someone here at church. It's not that I could, or that we can do anything different about the circumstances, and we have followed through by getting in touch with many people for the last three months. They need to hear from someone else. And so that's what we're inviting you to do, is you go to the, uh, the website for the church, and in the first part of the directory, you'll find all who are in, uh, that can't be reached. Their children can't go see them. Uh, some that we've lost has died and they couldn't even be with their children. So we ask you to please write, reach out to them, make a phone call, check on your neighbors. That's all we have. Thank you. Thank you.